Hello everybody, this is Scott, and today I'm actually addressing an issue, and that is Internet Explorer 11. Yes, the entire browser itself is truly stupid. Well, let me tell you why. The Internet Explorer 11 brought a lot of great things, more security, and uh, what they claim would be a smarter browser. Now I'm going to go to Google.com, and I'm going to show you an issue, and I already know how to resolve it. I'm going to type in Google, and full screen. Come on. No way. They may have fixed it. I doubt it. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to go here, here, and then come back and... Let me see. There was an issue with Chrome. Apparently, I... They have already fixed it, or maybe it's running a cached version, or I don't know. But let me tell you what the fa what the actual issue was. Google.com would not work. Why would Google.com not work? Because you see, your on Google you have your list right here. A very very simple search engine. Unfortunately on some internet browsers this was not the case. Some people claim that the images would be they they'd be scrunched together. They'd, like all the context instead of being on this line would be like right here and try to like format it and it would look like cra it would look crazy. Well it's actually a fairly simple issue. All you have to do is go to your compatibility view settings and you see display internet settings and compatibility view. Actually there we go. This is what it looks like without with their compatibility settings. And you were supposed to turn off the both of these are good to remove. And then it should fix. I don't know why it's actually working right now, but I'm not gonna try and force it to work to look stupid. But yes, that does have the this simple fix in Internet Explorer 11. I don't know why it does this. I think it's because it's trying to use like an older like form of Google or something I don't I don't know but it's it's been kind of stupid Internet Explorer has always been like the joke of internet browsers developer tools kind of lame like yeah lame I kind of like how they did this but the developer tools were better are better now but it's their move to be the tiles system it's there's nothing wrong with the tiles but the problem is they're the only ones that find it necessary as i mentioned before internet internet security companies were doing it uh... some are backtracking on the idea who may mainly have asked have asked did not no one liked the version 8 everyone hated that interface avast then changed it to go back to avast 7 interface but they did 2014 so yes internet explorer in the end of itself is never an intelligent browser and i think it's about time that i do another browser test by running it through simple testing and see what it spits out i'll probably do it within recent times i don't know when so, uh, thank you very much for watching. Please stay tuned for another video. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask them in the comments below, and I will try to answer them. Thank you very much for watching, and goodbye.